Together with some 13 million people in northwest China's Xi'an, Canadian businessman John Carmichael has been under lockdown for over a week due to the latest COVID-19 resurgence. He was surprised by the city's capacity in epidemic prevention and control. I think those people are very admirable. Obviously, you know, they sit out all day in their uh, containment suits and it's winter, so it's cold. And then the various volunteers go around floor by floor of the buildings and tell people, OK, it's time for you to go. And they make it as convenient and safe as possible. So this is a very good thing. In fact, um, our immediate neighbors um, have also volunteered. So it's a college age boy and his mother and they help to organize things. So this is all very good. And the other thing is that people are very good humored about it. Everybody's cooperating, nobody's complaining. Uh, everything is just fine. The major difference would be in the ability of the society to organize itself, to do things like get everybody to agree on a common strategy and see it through. And that requires cooperation of the people and the police and the government and the communities. And as you can see this time around, uh, the communities themselves have taken upon its themselves with the volunteer type people to deliver food and do the testing and whatever. And so it's the ability to quickly mobilize people that differentiates this society from others. People mobilizing quickly and cooperating together in this fashion is the best way to accomplish anything of this nature, be it a virus or an earthquake or a flood or whatever. So just the ability to organize the communities here is far better than in other places. Carmichael came to Xi'an in 2018 and started his own business. He got married here as well. 